Pentagon is sending a secretive new weapon to Ukraine to help fight against Russia, and it was developed right here in California. That's right. It's kind of like what they call a kamikaze attack drone from our San Diego affiliate. Derek Stahl has some insight on how it works from experts with the company that makes it. The U.S. has already sent more than a thousand of these small exploding drones to the Ukrainian army. They're called switchblade drones because of the way their propellers rapidly unfold after they're fired from a launcher. But the latest military aid package to Ukraine includes a secretive new type of attack drone called the Phoenix Ghost. It was developed by a company called Avex Aerospace, headquartered in Solana Beach. The reason that we exist is to uh, empower people to make the world a safer place. And that's exactly what we're doing with the Phoenix Ghost program. Unfortunately, we're not really able to discuss the details in any any depth. CEO Brian Redeems leads the company of about 600 employees. He's a retired Air Force Lieutenant Colonel who helped oversee the flagship Predator drone during his stint in the military. We primarily focus on special customers who need things very quickly and that have um, very special requirements. Uh, and I guess the current situation in Ukraine is a is sort of an example of that kind of an activity. Redeems would not provide any details about the ghost, but the Pentagon has said they function in a similar way to switchblades seen in this Marine Corps training video. <laughs> switchblades are fired out of a tube and they're mounted with cameras and a warhead. Once the human operator finds a target, the drone dive bombs and detonates. Some models can blast holes in a tank. The benefit of those is you can shoot and scoot, as they say. You can shoot the weapon and then leave so that you can't be targeted. National security expert Ron B says these drones are called loitering weapons. They can hang out in the sky and verify targets before attacking them. The switchblade can hover for about 30 minutes, and there are reports the ghost can stay airborne for several hours. This is cutting edge drone technology that has not been used before in Ukraine. So this is a big step by the Biden administration to uh, buy these weapons. The Biden administration said it will send 121 Phoenix ghosts to Ukraine. They're expected to be used primarily in the east of the country, where the territory is rural and flat, and Russian forces are largely out in the open. Derek Stahl, ABC 10 News.